an unseen, unpiloted threat-terminating machine, has recently been released by the United States of America with the intention of destroying China in the event of a conflict, which is becoming an increasingly frequent occurrence. The X-47 drone is currently in operation. This drone, which is designed to be as stealthy as the B-2 Spirit and as lethal as the F-22 Raptor, will launch itself from the deck of the United States Navy Gerald Ford, which is the largest and most sophisticated aircraft carrier in the history of the United States Navy. Additionally, it will inflict crippling blows. Nevertheless, the United States Navy and the military as a whole first discarded the X-47, although it is an excellent aircraft. From this point of origin, the X-47 made a tremendous return that was worthy of being portrayed in a film. From the depths of questionable beginnings, the rest is a tale of ascending to the absolute pinnacle of success. X-47A is one of the options. Moreover, the X-47B was the only 1A aircraft to survive the forum. The United States Air Force and the United States Navy collaborated on a program to build a network system of high-performance unmanned air vehicles for use in 21st century combat tasks. This initiative resulted in the development of the X-47 AJUCUS, which stands for Joint Unmanned Combat Air Systems Program, was the name given to the program when it was first introduced in the year 2001. DARPA, which stands for the Defense Advanced Research Projects Agency, provided the funding for it. The first flight of the X-47A, which was a significant milestone, took place in February of 2003, with Northrop Grumman serving as the primary contractor. However, the X-47 SJUCAS program was stopped in February of 2006, three years after it had been initiated, as a result of the Quadrennial Defense Review that took place in 2006. At that period, the Navy had already developed a strong interest in the idea of unmanned jets that could define the battlefield. While the United States Air Force ultimately decided to go with a new bomber of the next generation, the United States Navy remained committed to a fighter drone and resurrected the Joint Unmanned Combat System, JUX program, under a new initiative known as the Unmanned Combat Air System Demonstrator Program. In 2007, the Naval Air Systems Command, also known as UCAS-D, awarded Northrop Grumman a contract to manufacture and demonstrate two X-47B aircraft as part of this program. The program's objective was to find a viable future carrier. Unmanned vehicles that are compatible and have capabilities that define the conflict are being carried on. Northrop Grumman worked together with other military industry giants to develop the UCASD program. These companies include Lockheed Martin, General Electric, Rockwell Collins, Goodrich, Parker Aerospace, Honeywell, GKN Aerospace, Wind River, Hamilton Sunstrand, Pratt & Whitney, Eaton, Moog, and Dell. In the end, a machine that was intelligent, invisible, lethal, and powerful was produced. This is the X-47B. The term smart refers to the significantly autonomous operations of the aircraft, which nonetheless allow for a certain amount of control to be exercised by human operators. Because of this, the flight route of the X-47B has been pre-programmed and a mission operator is being responsible for monitoring its activities. The term invisible refers to the stealth qualities of the aircraft, which render it almost invisible to radar and make it significantly more difficult for opponent systems to detect. Deadly in relation to the aircraft's extensive arsenal, which can contain up to 4,500 pounds of munitions. The ability of the aircraft to quickly identify sites of interest is another aspect that contributes to fatality. The avionics of the X-47B are so powerful that there is no place for enemies to hide if they find themselves within range of them. Also, once it is discovered, it is most likely goodbye. Electro-optics, infrared, synthetic aperture radar, inverse synthetic aperture radar, ground moving target indicator, electronic support measures, and marine moving target indicator sensors are all components of the ensemble of avionics components. Powerful in terms of the aircraft's propulsion system, which is a Pratt & Whitney F100PW220U engine that propels the aircraft to speeds that are just a hair short of half the speed of sound, to heights that can reach up to 40,000 feet, and to a range that can reach 2,400 miles. 
As the United States Air Force appears to still have some interest in lethal unmanned vehicles, the X-47B incorporates both probes and drogues from the United States Navy. Additionally, the X-47B is equipped with boom receptacle mechanisms from the United States Air Force. Both of these designs were intended to facilitate airborne refueling. In point of fact, the X-47B broke the record for the first unmanned aerial vehicle to successfully complete an aerial refueling mission, which it accomplished in April of 2015. This accomplishment distinguishes the X-47B from other unmanned aerial vehicles, UAVs, making it possible for it to carry out missions of long duration without having to return to the base. By utilizing cutting-edge technologies such as Global Positioning System, GPS, and Vision, the aircraft's autonomous aerial refueling system was able to successfully complete the intricate process. Not only does aerial refueling increase the range of the X-47B, but it also increases its operational versatility, which makes it the ideal instrument for use in both military and civilian contexts. With this new development, it is now possible to conduct reconnaissance flights across large distances. Both disaster monitoring and the delivery of merchandise over extensive distances are included. In addition to this, it offers military strategy choices that are more adaptable and effective when they are used in combat circumstances. The X-47B is the most reliable and advanced unmanned aircraft. Both of the X-47Bs were constructed as part of the UCAS-D program. By the end of October 2009, the first X-47B, which was given the designation AV-1, had been finished, including its structural proof testing. In the year 2010, it was sent to Edwards Air Force Base for the purpose of conducting flight tests. In March of 2011, the second AV-2 landed at the same base for testing, and it has been testing ever since it arrived the following year. A flying test of the X-47B was conducted for the first time in February of 2011. In November of 2012, the first launch of an X-47B catapult took place at an onshore catapult facility located at Naval Air Station Patuxent River. The initial one is at sea. December 2012 saw the conclusion of the best phase, which consisted of a series of deck handling trials that were conducted on board the USS Harry S. Truman. In addition, the X-47B was put through its paces in terms of its ability to launch, operate, and recover throughout a Navy carrier's operational area that extended for 57.5 miles. The X-47B has proven itself to be one of the most technologically advanced unmanned aerial vehicles in the world by passing test after test, causing jaws to drop and heads to roll to the ground. In spite of the fact that it is present in practically every sector that is worthy of mention, the most astounding aspect of the aircraft is found in its primary capabilities. The X-47B is the unmanned aerial vehicle, UAV, that other UAVs are modeled after. This aircraft is a genuinely important asset to the United States Navy since it combines the greatest features of both the bomber and fighter sectors. Because it possessed two essential abilities, in particular, it was able to achieve this position. By acting stealthily as a B-2 Spirit, this is possible. The historical stealth bomber known as the B-2 Spirit serves as a source of inspiration and comparisons for the X-47B. Despite the fact that the X-47B is a smaller carrier-based platform designed for autonomous operations, its stealth capabilities are conceptually comparable to those of the B-2, particularly in the areas of radar evasion, aerodynamic design, and materials engineering. The low observable technology of the B-2 Spirit, which was first developed in the late 1980s, is renowned for its ability to decrease the radar cross-section of the aircraft in order to avoid detection by the enemy. The unusual design of its flying wings removes sharp edges and vertical surfaces, which in turn reduces the amount of radar reflections. Similarly, the X-47B utilizes a tailless blended wing body design, which is reminiscent of a more diminutive and condensed version of the B-2. Because of the form, radar wavelengths are naturally scattered, which makes it harder for adversarial systems to synchronize with the aircraft. The B-2's philosophy of preferring smooth, 
continuous surfaces to promote stealth is mirrored by the X-47B, which has done away with traditional tail fins and protrusions in order to take advantage of this philosophy. The B-2's airframe is coated with radar-absorbent materials, which are another essential component of its stealth profile. These materials are designed to absorb electromagnetic energy that has not been scattered rather than reflecting it. It is generally accepted that the X-47B makes use of sophisticated composites and radar-absorbent materials, which are comparable to those utilized in the B-2. However, exact specifics regarding the X-47B's materials are still classified. The visibility of the aircraft to radar, infrared, and other detection modalities is reduced as a result of these composite materials. In comparison to the B-2, which spans 69 feet, the X-47B, which is 38 feet in length, has a lower size which further minimizes its radar cross-section. In certain circumstances, the engine architecture of the X-47B is reminiscent of the stealth-oriented propulsion of the B-2, which could make it even more difficult to detect than the B-2 in certain circumstances. Using four General Electric F-118 engines, the B-2 is powered. The X-47B, which is powered by a single Pratt & Whitney F-100 engine, incorporates a serpentine inlet and exhaust system that shields the engine's hot components from ground-based sensors. This system is buried deep within the structure of the vehicle, and the exhaust is positioned on the upper surface. This is done to minimize heat signatures that can be detected by infrared sensors. The same notion of masking thermal emissions, which is an essential component of avoiding current air defenses, is reflected in this configuration of the X-47B. This concept is extended into the unmanned realm by the XB-47, which offers a stealth platform that can operate from naval carriers. This is a testament to how stealth technology continues to evolve, as the B-2 has been valued for a long time for its ability to perform accurate strikes against high-value targets without being discovered. The goal is to reimagine aerial combat by combining capabilities similar to those of the B-2 with cutting-edge autonomy. To be sure, that is not everything. When it is in the role of an F-22 Raptor, the X-47B is not only as stealthy as a B-2 Spirit, but it is also extremely dangerous. The F-22. Raptor is a stealth fighter based on the fifth generation that was designed to achieve air superiority. Many people consider it the most dangerous fighter jet that has ever existed. It appears that the X-47 will be the most lethal drone in the history of the world, and it intends to accomplish this by combining stealth, autonomy, and precision strike capabilities. This task will be accomplished in a manner similar to that of the F-22, which employs sophisticated stealth coatings and angular geometry to elude enemy radar. The X-47B will have a low detectable profile, it provides the capability to operate in circumstances that could potentially be hazardous for conventional aircraft. To perform lethal strikes against high-value targets, such as enemy air defenses or command centers, without exposing oneself to retaliation, the stealth capability is very necessary. When specific circumstances are met, the X-47BS autonomy further boosts its lethal capacity making it possibly even more lethal than the F-22 Raptor under certain circumstances. During its historical aerial refueling mission in 2015, the X-47B demonstrated that it is capable of independently navigating complicated operational scenarios. From a theoretical standpoint, this autonomy could make it possible for it to carry out high-risk missions, such as suppressing enemy air defenses, in the same way that an F-22 pilot might. An important risk to consider. The X-47B was able to maintain operations in contested zones for longer periods of time and with higher precision, greatly increasing its lethality. This improvement was made possible by the removal of the human element. To maintain its stealth profile, the X-47B was designed with a payload capacity of around 4,500 pounds, which was carried in internal weapon space. This was done to facilitate the aircraft's weapons. This method is identical to the one that the F-22 takes with regard to its internal weapons carriage. Although the X-47B was not operationally armed during the testing phase, the payload capacity of the aircraft indicates that it is capable of deploying precision-guided ordnance such as 
anti-ship missiles or bombs with a small diameter, an effect that is terrible. This capacity links it with the F-22's multi-role adaptability, which enables it to engage in air-to-ground strikes as well as those that might potentially involve air-to-air -air combat if it is outfitted with the necessary weapons. A further factor that contributes to the X-47B's potential for lethality is its endurance. It is superior to the F-22 in terms of its unrefueled range, which is around 1,840 miles, since it has a range that is greater than 2,760 miles and the capability to refuel itself independently. The X-47B is able to loiter above target regions, carry out persistent reconnaissance, and strike when possibilities present themselves thanks to its expanded reach. With capabilities that significantly boost its strategic significance, it was almost as if a little version of the F-22 was brought into play. The X-47B is a lethal asset, although it lacks the agility and air-to-air -air combat focus of the F-22. However, the combination of stealth, autonomy, and strike capacity that it possesses makes it a lethal asset nonetheless. It represents a future in which unmanned systems could rival or augment the capabilities of advanced fighters such as the F-22, thereby forever altering the landscape of aerial warfare. On the other hand, unmanned aerial systems are here to stay, with the X-47B serving as the pioneer in this revolution. After surviving corporate cancellation in the X-47A, this unmanned vehicle has been resurrected with new capabilities that will make history. These capabilities incorporate those of iconic aircraft such as the B-2 Spirit and the F-22 Raptor to create a truly lethal machine that will launch from aircraft carrier decks to dominate the skies of the future. To enable the X-47B, you must approve this video and subscribe to this channel. So go ahead and do that, and I appreciate you watching.